When most people think of farm animals, they think of cows or pigs or chickens that provide humans with meat, milk, or eggs. Yet even at farms that only grow plants, animals are important. Creatures one would normally take for granted provide a wide array of economic and environmental benefits to the farm and the wider landscape. These benefits are known as ecosystem services. Consider the growing wheat. All plants need water, but it can't always reach the roots way down in the soil. Yet as the humble earthworm burrows to the ground, it creates channels for water to flow. The wheat is also plagued by pest insects like aphids, which drain the sap from its stems and reduce its growth. Yet when the predatory lady beetle makes a meal of them, the wheat is spared and the farmer is kept from needing to apply as many pesticides. Meanwhile, the farm's apple trees are blooming, but it takes a bee to turn the flowers into red delicious fruit come autumn. As it probes the flower for nectar, the bee's hairy body gets dusted with pollen, which can then transfer to other flowers, fertilizing them and allowing the fruit to grow. In the fall, the apples are picked and the wheat is harvested. The farm has much to thank its animals for, but there remains one more service to perform. As the leaves fall from the apple trees, animals like this isopod, as well as numerous microbes too small to see, will break them down and release the nutrients locked up inside returning them to the soil so that the trees can keep growing year after year. These are just a few of the many ways ecological communities contribute to human society. Preserving and managing these and other ecosystem services is an important part of good environmental stewardship.